Hello and welcome to the channel. I'm sure you know that to remove the rocker arms from the cylinder head of your CT90 or your CT110 you need to take off this side cover and pull out the rocker shafts. But what if the shafts are seized in place? How do you get them out without damaging your cylinder head? If that's something you're interested in finding out, stick around and I'll get straight into it. Well, I know I said I was going to discard this cylinder head, but I wanted to remove the rockers and the rocker shafts. See if there's something that I could salvage. And I've taken the cover off here, and what you usually do, you just gently tap the head, and these rocker shafts slide out. But as per usual, with everything on this engine, they're seized in there. Some of these engines have a thread, so you can thread a bolt in there and pull it out, but these don't, they're just plain, so how do you get in there to pull these out? Well, I'm going to try and use a diner bolt, put it in, tighten it up, and then see if I can grab it somehow and slowly work these shafts out. Lots of rust around them, probably seized. Let's see how we go. So. Seems pretty tight. Now no. It's just pulling the bolt out at the moment. This might be a failure to have a look at it. Well, that's moving it. So, let's see if I can work it out somehow. Hopefully, you can see. I'm oh, surprised. I was just about to give up. Back in it goes. Excellent. Try, try the next one. Leave enough room to grab it this time. And that one's coming out as well. There we go. Quick, easy way to remove the rocker shaft, the rust on there, a couple of diner bolts, and away you go. I hope you enjoyed the videos. If you gain some value out of them, consider subscribing. And I'll see you again soon in the next video.